Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you're unable to open Windows security and if you're receiving this error which says your IT administrator has limited access to some areas of this app. So please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to find any working Windows 11 computer. So if you have any other Windows 11 computer where Windows security is working fine, in that case you can go to this location so go to this location that is open file explorer and then go to this pc open c drive now open windows folder and then open system 32 folder so find system 32 open system 32 folder now find security health folder now open security health folder now over here here you can see security health setup so you have to copy this exe file so copy it you can copy this file and then you can transfer it to external hard drive or flash drive. So you can connect your external storage over here and then paste the file over here. In my case, I already have it. Now, once you have this security health setup, uh, you can just copy this file. Now you have to connect the external flash drive or hard drive to your uh, computer where Windows security is not working. In that, connect it and then copy this file. And then you can go to this PC on the computer where the Windows security is not working. Copy C drive, open C drive, Windows folder, system32 folder, and then open security health folder. And you can paste the file over here. So paste this security health setup exe over here. And then restart your computer. And after the system restart check if that does not work you can run this security health setup as an administrator so copy this make a right click make a right click on security health setup and then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow and now once done now restart your computer simply restart your computer once and then check now if that does not work like if you don't have any other Windows 11 computer, in that case, you can find this security health setup dot zip file. So you can go to Google and you can type in security health setup zip. And then you can go to Microsoft forum. And then over here, you can see download security health setup dot zip. So this file is there on Microsoft forum. So now it's there. It may not be in future. So you can try this if you find this. So if you trust this uh, file, if you don't trust it, you can, uh, you don't have to do it. But if you trust it, just click on it. It is on Microsoft forum and for many user, this has worked. So you can try this. So you can click on download. And then go to the down download location. So it will go to downloads over here. Now make a right click and then click on extract all. So you have to unzip it, extract. Now open and here you can see security health setup. Make a right click and then click on run as administrator. Click on yes to allow. And once that is done, restart your computer. Make sure that you restart your computer. And after the system restart, you can open Windows security and it should work fine. You should not receive that error anymore or you should not see the blank screen. Now still you are facing the problem. In that case, run these commands. These commands are provided in the video description. So type in CMD in Windows search box, make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator. Click on yes to allow. Now copy the first command. Now paste it over here, but make sure that you open command prompt as an administrator. So otherwise you will receive access denied. So whenever you open command prompt, so make a right click, click on run as administrator. This is must. Now copy the command, paste it over here, hit the enter key. Once done, restart your computer. Restart is a must after this. Restart your computer and then after the system restart, you can check Windows security. If that does not work, run the second command all the commands are provided in the video description 
now type in cmd once again and then make a right click and then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow paste the command hit the enter key once done again restart your computer and then check the windows security if that does not work then run these two commands so again type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app click on run as administrator click on yes to allow and run these two commands paste it over here hit the enter key copy it if you receive this access denied just ignore it paste it over here hit the enter key once done restart the computer after the system restart you can try opening windows security and then check now still you are facing the problem the last step is to update your windows 11 using media creation tool go to this website here also you will find media creation tool click on download now and then run this exe file click on yes to allow now this will load windows 11 media creation tool now click on accept by default windows 11 would be selected click on next select iso file then click on next you can save the location you can set the location as desktop and then click on save over here now once the download is complete click on finish and then go to desktop find windows iso file make a double click on windows iso file then run the setup file make a double click on setup file click on yes to allow this will load windows 11 now and here you can see install windows 11 click on next it will check for update then click on accept again it will check for update now before the installation you will see the screen which says ready to install and by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer click on install after the installation log into your computer so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get the windows security working on your windows 11 computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel